recording sunglasses slash glasses this is how they look and I ordered these off of Amazon and if you go to Amazon this is what the product would say OHO 64 gig gigabyte camera and you can read the rest right there that's what that says and these are some nice little glasses this is how they look your record button is right there you press it one time to record you can press it a second time to take a picture but the first time you press it is gonna start recording to uh, to take a picture you just press it press it one time while it's recording it'll take a snapshot and to turn it off you'll hold this button down right here for about three seconds and then it'll turn off this right here this little circle in the middle that's your camera right there and I did have a problem out of these glasses well let me show you a couple more things that this thing what what these glasses come with it comes with a little manual right here well it don't come with these screwdrivers right here but it comes with this thing right here that you can wrap around the back of your head and so the sunglasses won't come off it also comes with a charger a USB charger looks like that it also comes with it comes with your clear um, clear lenses and it also comes with black and like a blue color lens that looks pretty cool and, it, and these are the black ones you can pop these out they're pretty easy to pop out you just push from the inside and pop them out like that and you can just put, pop them back in but you want to be kind of careful and be kind of gentle with them when you're doing that these glasses also come with a a pouch like this where you can keep all your lenses and your charger and everything and it also comes with a little pouch a silk pouch and it also comes with this little brown thing to clean your lenses with okay now this part of the video I want to show you what happened to mine when I when I was about to record with them one day, I could they wouldn't record, and I would press the button and it wouldn't record. So what I did was, if you look real closely, hold on one second, let me zoom in a little bit. If you look real closely, right here and right there, there's two little notches right there. And what I did to get these out was I took a needle. I had this needle already. You take this needle and you poke it into the this little round thing right here. And you pull out. And it pops out like that. Now you can see that screw. That's right here. Well, let me let my camera zoom in. It's a screw behind that one. And this is on the, the left side of the glasses. You want to put your... You can see here. My hand, I know my hand going to get in the way, but stick it in. Make sure you stick the sharp part in and pull out like that and it comes out on the end of the needle this is a regular needle okay once you do that I already had like a small screwdriver it looks like this as you can see and you want to loosen these bolts right here these screws with your small screwdriver they're right there you can see them it's one right here and there's one right there so I already got these loosened and I had a flat this is a flat head one of them is a Phillips head which is what you need to take the screw out with 
and this one is a flat head. So I'm gonna pry, I'm gonna take my flat head, see if I can get a good view, come in right here and pry this up. And once she pry this up right here, it should come up. And it looks like that in the inside. And what I did was, let me let my camera zoom. That's how it looks once you take your two screws off. And then, let me show you guys a product. You can get this from Lowe's or either Home Depot. Or you might can get it from, um, let's see, Office, Office Depot. And this, it's not a wet spray because it says moisture free make sure it say moisture free compression gas duster and it says a hundred percent ozone safe and it has dust and lint removal and it's called duster by crc and what i did was it stopped working i took my spray right here and sprayed and blew blew this panel right here off pretty good and then what I did was I put this back where it was supposed to be well I'm not gonna put the screws on tightly yet I'm just gonna show you that it works now and I press the button and now it's recording now Cause you see the light flashing so I'm gonna well, I'm not gonna do it right now but I'm gonna show you I'm gonna tighten these two screws back up put the two rubber pieces back in and that's what made my glasses start working again so if you guys purchase these glasses a lot of people don't want to go inside of them all you got to do just get your needle and take those two rubber things out. You got to stab the rubber thing and then pull out. And then you'll have your screws set right there. Then you take your dust spray and you spray that, that panel in there. And um, it's like a little circuit board inside here. And I guess some dust or something got between something. So I just had to spray it. So if you guys haven't have these glasses, give this a try. And it's, it's another one on this side. I never did take this side off. I just did this side right here, the side with the button on it that you record with. I just sprayed that and put it back on and it started working. And I'm gonna tighten up these two screws, put the two rubber stoppers back in here and she's ready to go. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know if that helps. Like and subscribe.